Going to therapy is becoming more normalized and a lot of people are talking about their experiences, especially online. But should you be discussing something so personal on social media? It's normal to feel fearful of oversharing, but a lot of people online are actually pretty supportive according to HuffPost. Some people post about it because they want others to know that they're not alone and that seeking help is always an option. Others post about it so that they can inform their audience should they have any questions about therapy and what it's like. It's also okay to keep some things to yourself. If you want to post about your sessions, maybe you should leave personal details out so you're just focusing on the experience overall as opposed to the details of what you're working on. If you'd rather keep therapy altogether private, that's okay too. Whatever choice you make, it should come from a place of empowerment. The New York Times reports that patients aren't the only ones posting about therapy. Since therapy is not accessible to everyone, a lot of therapists are trying to reach people via Instagram and other platforms. They post about things like embracing your imperfection, self-care, imposter syndrome, and trauma. Following some therapists is a great way to start thinking about your mental health and may prepare you for therapy if you decide to go for it down the line.